Carlson. Uh, <laughs> gentlemen, when will you release your tax return specifically? An hour ago. <laughs> uh, Mr. Speaker posted his online an hour ago. We know that Congressman Paul will come down the line. Congressman Paul, I want to start with you. We reached out to your campaign this week, and they said you would not release your tax returns. Why? Well, well I hadn't thought it, thought it through. I don't have an intention of doing it. But for a different reason, I'd probably be embarrassed to put my financial <laughs> statement up against their income. And I don't want to be embarrassed because I don't have a greater income. <laughs> now, um, I mean, it may come to that, but uh, right now I have no intention of doing that. I think uh, with our financial statements, congressional financial statements, I think you know more about me than I know about myself. You, how, that's how my wife found out so much about what we were doing, you know, from my financial statements. Now, we don't need, I don't think people need that uh, because nobody's challenging me because I have no conflict of interest and I don't even talk to lobbyists and, uh, and I don't take that kind of money. So there's no conflict. Uh, uh Governor Romney, when will we see yours? Uh, when my taxes are complete for this year, and I know that if I'm the nominee, the president's going to want to insist that I show what my income was this last year and so forth. When they're completed this year in April, I'll release my returns in April and probably for other years as well. Um, and I, I know that's what's going to come. Every time the Democrats are out there trying their very best, to, uh, to try and uh, attack people because they've been successful. And, and, I, and I have been successful. But let me tell you, the, the, the challenge in America is not people have been successful. The challenge in America, and President Obama doesn't want to talk about this, is you got a president who's played 90 rounds of golf while the 25 million Americans out of work. And, 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 you've got, and, and while the price of gasoline has doubled, he said no to the Keystone Pipeline. And, and while we've got 15 trillion of debt, he, he said, look, I, I'm going to put another trillion of debt for Obamacare. Right. That's the problem in America, not the attacks they make on people who've been successful. But some of the questions about when you release your taxes have not come. The, the president has raised them. His campaign has raised them. You're right on that. But so have some of your rivals up here. Speaker Gingrich has said you owe them to the people of South Carolina before they vote. Governor Perry made that point as well before he left the race. Why not should the people of South Carolina before this election see last year's return? Uh, because I want to make sure that I beat President Obama. And every time we release things drip by drip, the Democrats go out with another array of attacks. I, I, as, as has been done in the past, if I'm the nominee, I'll put these out at one time so we have one discussion of all of this. Uh, I obviously pay all full taxes. I'm honest in my dealings with people. People understand that. My taxes are carefully managed. And uh, I pay a lot of taxes. I've been very successful, and I w when I have our, our taxes ready for this year, I'll release them. Speaker Gingrich, is that good enough? Uh, look, he's got to decide, and the people of South Carolina have to decide. But if there's anything in there that is going to help us lose the election, we should know it before the nomination. And if there's nothing in there, if there's nothing in there, why not release it? I mean, it's a very simple model. And, but as he's got to decide, it's his decision, and everybody's got to run their own campaign based on what they think is the reasonable risk. I, filed, I, I released mine this evening. We also released uh, the little small charitable foundation we have so people can see what we do and how we did it and what our values are. Senator Santorum, when will we see yours? Well, I do my own taxes, and, uh, and they're on my computer, and I'm not home. So, uh, <laughs> and there's nobody at home right now. Until I get home, I won't get them. When I get home, I'll, you'll get my taxes. But you, you did call on the governor to release his. Well, I, no, someone asked me, would it be okay for the governor? I said, yes. I, I, didn't I don't think it's a big deal. I mean, if uh, Governor Romney's told what his tax rate is, mine's higher than that, I can assure you. But uh, I can't tell you what it was. I, all I know is it was very painful writing a check last April. That's all I can tell you. I, I wanna, governor Romney, you mentioned that.